Well, next up for Advent Calendar is, uh... One of the lesser-known Kirby games out there, Kirby Mass Attack. Yay! Now, we are no stranger to Kirby here on Ultra Director Jester's channel, hell no! But this one is a bit of a different one. And that's kind of why... One of the reasons why we never really did a series on it. Yeah, I, I always wondered why we never tackled this one, because we had the technology, it was there, it was ready to go. But I, I really wanted to see what a Kirby veteran had to say about it. It works better as a one-shot, and, uh, well, let's just start a new game and get going. Okay. So, options, yeah, right-handed. It looks okay. cute. It's definitely got the style going. Oh, sure. One day, Kirby went exploring in the <gasps> Po 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 Islands in the south of Popstar. Oh? He was snoozing in a field, napping the day away. Aww. <laughs> and then he died. But then dark clouds filled the sky and a skull-faced fiend descended. Oh, another nightmarish being? Wow. Dime a dozen. It was Necrodeus, the leader of the Skull Gang. Okay. The Skull Gang wanted to drown light in darkness. <laughs> okay. Okay, Edgelord, ah! jeez. Necrodeus raised his staff and struck Kirby with his mischievous no! magic. Necrodeus oh. split Kirby into ten copies of himself, huh. each having only a fraction of Kirby's greatness. Kirby's greatness, huh? The Fiend was easily able to defeat each of these weaker Kirbys. Oh no! Before long, there was only one Kirby left. Okay, so he didn't do anything. Popstar was about to lose its greatest defender and plunge into darkness forever. As the last Kirby <laughs> raised his head, he saw, he saw a star shining brightly. Jesus! That light was from Kirby's own heroic heart, which had flown to safety. What? His heart called out to him. Kirby, follow me! We can fight Necrodeus together! Get up, bro! I can't get it. Well, see ya! Cool. So began Kirby's quest to save Popstar and restore Kirby back to his usual self! Oh. If they could defeat Necrodeus, they could use his magic staff to make everything right. Oh, cool. Time for the game. So, for for the DS, you had a uh, Kirby Canvas Curse, which was strictly touch-based. Mm -hmm. You had Kirby Squeak Squad, which was strictly uh, buttons. This is a hybrid. This is kind of like a, a traditional platforming Kirby game, but it's all through touch controls, you'll see. Okay. This is a stage. Oh, oh, thank you. Thank you, video this game. This number shows how many Kirbys you need to enter the stage. You can have up to ten. So oh. Here we go. So you can lose Kirbys and you won't be able to enter stages? You need to get more. Oh. Okay. Alright, go. Show me. Touch the screen to make Kirbys... Make the star appear and Kirby will follow it. Oh. Oh, it's... Okay. Gotcha. See, uh, when, when I saw the, uh, w what is the canvas one on uh, Wii U? Rainbow Curse. Rainbow Curse. When that came out, I thought, man, that sounds good, but that just sounds like a nightmare to control. This one, at least, you could just point and Kirby will go there. You don't actually have to draw a pathway for him. I would love to do Rainbow Curse. That's the one game I haven't played. Oh, well, I own it. I think. Yeah, I own it. I would love to play that. Cool. All right, chase that guy down. He owes you a fresh apple pie. Oh. Well, he lives. <sighs> lives to see another day. Well, Kirby won't stand for this. To carry Kirby, move the star onto him, then draw a line. Oh, it's the same thing! Lovely. Yeah. All right, now get him. Oh, God! No, 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 no! <laughs> the destroyer is here! No! No, 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 wait, wait, wait. Wait, 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 wait! <laughs> so now you need to draw an... Oh. Obstacles. He is ready to defend his life. Well, good for him. I'm glad he has some self-preservation. Now destroy it. Wait, how are you doing that? You can fling Kirby. Oh. So the unfortunate design flaw in this guy's house is uh, he left a bomb right next to uh, to all this stuff. Yikes. Yeah. 
So this gets the point across. It's got the cuteness of Kirby. It's got the controls of basically every Kirby up until now. If you move into an enemy, he'll go to work pummeling the foe. Good lord! Create violence, Kirby! He actually is beating him up. That's... When you get wow. ten, and when you get ten of the things, they all like gather up and just be, just uh, jump. <laughs> they jump them. Yeah, angry mob Kirby. <laughs> okay, there's ten. That that just looks silly. <laughs> I do love it though, where he just like just touches them and then just goes. <laughs> oh, nice. So a hundred fruit. What does that equal? Another Kirby. Oh, so you're trying your best to get all ten Kirbys. Oh wow, that was some... That was actually some really good juggling there, mate. Thank you. You got rent, uh, Kirby medals, so there are collectibles in here. That's good. Just like any other Kirby game. You got your collectibles if you want 100% it. Is it pretty responsive? I'd say so. Because I, I know I can see you playing it, but uh, I don't know how, like, actually responsive Kirby is. Well, have you played a Tilt and Tumble yet? Uh, yeah. Now that yeah. it's actually on Switch Online, yeah, I yeah. never expected that. People can play for themselves and they can see how fucking bad it is. I was having <coughs> some enjoyment, but yeah, it's it's pretty rough. Yeah, it's 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 bad. I I I, I can say confidently that it is bad. Because I don't think it was a Kirby game to start with. I think it was just an idea for a gyroscope based game that they had, and then yeah, they yeah. threw they just tossed Kirby on it. As you do, as you do. Yeah. I don't know if you're going for all the metals, but uh, I have a feeling there's something on top of this like little building area that you're in that you can access from the opening, but I'm not sure. What do you think? I think so. Well, I can't go back anyway, so... Well, alright, it's just gone forever. Because I noticed the camera's kind of zooming upward, so I'm not sure. No, you haven't missed anything. Here! Yeah. Oop! I think we need more Kerbos for that one. More Kerbos for this one, really? Yep. Okay. Gotta get more Kerbos. So do you have to come back to old levels with more Kirbys? Yep. Really? Just for mm. 100%, right? Or is it for just beating the game? 100% slash beating the game, you okay. know. That's a lot of fruit. Here we go. Here's another Kirby! There's two Kerbos now! Now there's two mouths to feed! Oh my god, that tree. Oh my god, that tree. Can we, oh. get, can we get him now? Oh, we need more than two! Oh, one more fruit. Could get it. Maybe. Three Kerbs. Hey, you! Give me fruit. Oh, Ooh, there we three go. Three of them! Yeah, three Kerbs! And <laughs> just beating up on this... Four defenses bird! Boosh! Alright, three's gotta do it, right? <laughs> Let's go, boys! Where are we dropping? Uh, nope! Nope! What do you need, like, six of well, them? We gotta, we gotta basically play the level over again with more Kirbys and get to that part again. Okay. So your Kirbys can actually die. Yeah! This will bring them, I wouldn't say back to life, but they go from blue to pink. Huh, okay. Oh! If you clear this stage, you can just warp ahead. Oh, that's... that's actually nice. Cause things are about to get fun, boys! Okay, okay. I see their angle. I see what they're doing to just kind of cut down on the grind. You'll love to see it. That guy was actually getting mad. He was, he was getting ready to do he was, something. He was getting heated. Just, just thinking. Oh my God, this Kirby guy, and you turned into a, a sucker, I think, or I got maybe, caught. I got caught like a like a grape bubble or something. Maybe juice. You gotta suck your way out of those. Boosh! Juice. Ripped off his head, and then Izuna dropped the head on its way down. Fuck yeah, that's what Kirby's all about, bro. This game is ready to eat for everyone. Are you sure? Okay. So, I don't know why. Maybe it's just the sprites. Maybe it's the sound effects, but this reminds me of a GBA game. It's the sprites. So, are, have they used these sprites for the GBA Kirby games? It does look very much like Squeak Squad. Okay. 
So yeah. Like you know the the that company kind of went out of business soon after making Squeak Squad. Oh no. So I guess they kind of reused some of their assets to make this. Well, that's good. And then they made they gave the people what they really wanted. Three years back with Superstar Ultra. Ooh. Yeah, I'm glad you told me that Superstar Ultra wasn't just a retread of Superstar, like they actually added stuff and made it better. Yeah, they new, new cutscenes, new games. Beautiful. And I got it while it was still relatively cheap. Before DS games became impossible to buy. Is it, is it not cheap anymore? Uh, basically, ev every good title and a lot of niche games are like impossible nowadays. Well, there goes my dreams of ever getting Professor Layton 6. Jeez. <laughs> Meow! Oh. Well. Sorry, Farmer Pecker. I had to steal everything from you. We'll get a fifth Kirby here soon, I'm sure. <laughs> when me and the boys on Taco Tuesday. <laughs> <laughs> just, just running ahead. She's going to be like, oh my god! Five for a dollar! <laughs> Congrats on getting a uh, majority of the medals. I assume the fifth one is underneath that, or on top of that turnip. I assume that one is the one that we couldn't get yet because uh -oh. we don't have enough uh, Kirby's. That's the first stage. No damage. How about the at? You've got a gold star. Watch for these bubbles. Pop them to move onward. Okay. Oh. I can't. Boosh! Awesome! So, the way that stages work in this game is that you, you, you can do like two or three stages at a time. Only one of them will give you a bridge so you can move into the inner ring of the level. Oh my. Interesting. You completed more of the checklist! I'll show this off when we're about done here, but uh, we got a checklist here. We can unlock a whole bunch of stuff. Oh, that's cool. Secret tasks, too. Wow. Are these like the achievements of the game? Yeah. We got a gold star. So collect everything, beat every level, stuff like that. Get get medals and stuff get like medals. that, too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. All right. All right. So uh, two or three. Oh, uh, let's do uh, let's go numerical. We hit up two. All right. So this was just one of those where you thought it'd be better just to show it off one time and that'd be that'd be good. If I were to go into one of the weirder Kirby games, Canvas Curse is a better chance of being a series than this. Okay. Come on! Come on, there boys! There you go. Yeah! Unless, unless I'm supposed to be tapping to help him out, but... I can't do everything for him! Well, this also kind of seems... Uh, I don't know what the pro proper word oh, is, wording is for it, but... It doesn't feel like the Kirby games we've covered, if that makes sense. Yeah, like it's, it's, it's very different. It's very different. Like, there's not- I don't think there's even really abilities in this game. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry! But there's still some fun moments, to be sure. <laughs> God, those guys! Uh, the last thing they saw was just Kirby and the boys uh -huh. coming down. Yeah, exactly. Oh, banana. Take him out! Yeah, you weren't kidding. There are no, uh, are no copy abilities. If he gets hit again, they die. Send him back into action. Okay. He gets thrown off. Get him! There we go! So I guess technically this is... I mean, not actually, but... Alternate title for this could be Kirby right back at ya! Toss him directly there. Some people call this Kirby Mass Effect. Hmm... I'm trying to piece that together why, and I feel silly for not immediately understanding that. This, this way, guys. No! Fuck. Idiots. Now we'll never get that thing that we needed. The melons. No. Oh, I see. Bip. Bip. Bap. Bip. 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 Bap. Up. Yeah, you did it! Now save me from feeling depression, Kirby. Oh. There we go. I was about to say, that didn't count? 
Okay. Oh. So you showed how weight kind of works for breaking platforms or whatever. Is it always dependent on where you throw them from? Ah! Fuck. I needed to be sure. That sucks. Did I just tap the box? Nope, I have to actually make him hit it. Alright, now I'm seeing why we're just chilling with a, with an advent for this. That makes a lot more sense. Mm-hmm. Alright, kill this guy. The, it's, I, it's, I guess it's one more hit a, kill, yeah. He's more a puzzle platformer than anything, really. I don't know, I just can't find enough interesting things to do with this. Okay. For an entire series. Well, I mean, this game also can't be, like, extremely long, right? Longer than you might think. See, it's, really? it's, it's just that it feels long, you know? Mm, okay. I, I do think the the effect of you and all of your other Kirby's just dogpiling every single enemy is extremely funny imagery, but uh, I know that wouldn't last forever. You know what's really irritating? What? Let's say I'm at level four, like I actually was, yeah. and I want to go back to level one to show off stuff for the advent calendar. I start at one Kirby. Eh? No matter what. Every time I go from level to level, I restart Kirby, so I can't just go to like level five or whatever. I have to, have to start at level one to get Kirby's to get enough to enter the stage. Why? Just, just little, little things like that that just. Uh, oh, that's not that fun. So, okay. So the Kirby's you've accumulated don't save if you want to go backwards. Nope. You just gotta get one. I mean, if I'm if I'm still on level four or whatever, I can still keep as many Kirby's as I want. But if I want to go from level four to level one, well, then I have to go all the way back. And so there's no going out of numerical order, basically. I mean, I can go in numerical order, but let's say I, you know, I, I finish Green Grounds, I go to I go to stage two, but I want to go back to, to to World One to get the medals I missed. I have to start from one Kirby when I enter that. Okay. Dislike. Dislike. That's. I was about to say that's so going right. There we go. Now it's going left. Shit. That's going get, right. All right. Oh, everybody over here. Everybody over here. All right. Now so get yeah, over there. Yeah, it kind of gives off the vibe of corralling children. And boosh. <laughs> yeah, immediately. There he goes. Oh no! Get him! Grab him before he flies off. Save his ghost. <laughs> Jeez! I saw him pile drive his ghost. See, any Kirby game that doesn't have a whole lot of powers or like no powers at all, that's yeah. that's. Kind of going against, uh... Boosh, 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 boosh. Not to say there aren't some ideas here and there that are worthy of merit. Right. There are just some things that work better for a one-time go. Without question. Nice, you got the key. We love it. That guy's just having a conniption up there. He's just having a time. Why am I still up here? There we Get go. Get me down! <laughs> Kirby with a key just going, Guys! Where'd you go? Oh yeah, here we go. Oh, such visceral sound effects. <laughs> See, I never played any of the DS... Uh, b barely any of the 3DS Kirby games. I just never, never took the Kirby plunge until a lot later. Thanks to me, probably. Most likely, yeah. Like, I remember picking up Triple Deluxe, and it was a grand fun time. I beat it in a weekend. Probably some of the most fun I've ever had, and I was like, why did I sleep on Kirby? So, one good thing about this game is the extras in this game are excellent. Are they as good as, say, current? There's a lot of mini-games. Oh, good! Like, Field Frenzy here. <laughs> I love this mole man. See, we do one more stage, and then I'll show you all these mini-games. Okay. Yeah, show it off. We got spiders now. 
What then we go. Maybe we'll get full tent this time. Yeah, what happens if you try to go into a stage and you don't have enough Kirby's? You can't. Oh. But it actually stops you at the at the opening cutscene there? Well, yeah, because you can't. That's hilarious. The game throws challenges that you're expected to have a certain amount of Kirby's to, to, to need. Huh. Because there's no, like, it's, it's not like Yoshi's Island where you can just hit a block and get all your eggs back. Yeah, right, right, right. You actually need to, you need to get fruit. You need to, to organically earn them by eating fruit and defeating enemies and this, that, and the other. <laughs> okay. Seeing all the Kirby's run and their running animations, they all sound like they're yelling. Pile drive spider! Is he looking at that guy in the back? He's just like, hop, 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 hop! Get him! Get him! Hurt him a lot! Destroy that spider. Jesus. Yeah, you can't even see their corpses anymore. Kirby has actively destroyed them. <laughs> we and, made him even more powerful! More, and now there's one more. Oh no. Oh, you actually saw its little cry face! <laughs> Oh no! Oh my god. So much destruction, so much chaos. Uh oh. Wow, you actually Get him! you actually sent one of your Kirby's as a decoy so that you could destroy the spider quicker. God. Do they all strike a pose when you kill a monster? I don't think so. That's interesting. Uh let th let them cook, let them kill something, and then see what happens. Oh, some of them do. I, I think it's just them landing. Oh, okay. Alright. The squad is here to fight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you're punching him right in the nuts! Oh, just pummeling his nuts! Good lord, speed bag that sack! Speed bag that tea bag. Only in a Kirby game would you ever hear this. He has angry eyes in this one. Oh, he does. This is before he got he got nice. Oh yeah, he does have the 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 American angry eyes. I wonder if that's the same for uh for the Japanese. Probably not, because he's nice in Japan. He is. Oh shit. Oh no. Oh. Get him! Well, they're not getting here. More Kirby's, more power. I'm reading the box here. Gather a mob of Kirby's and lead them on a crazy adventure where nothing can stand in your way. Except everything. Uh, let's see. Fling Kirby's into the air. Take on big challenges with strength of many Kirby's. Send Kirby swarming over your enemies. So, yeah, mob boss Kirby just ain't having any of it. You send these other Kirby's in here to destroy everything they hold dear. Their attack is actually called pummeling. I love that. Also, I love this. Special little note, be careful not to tap too hard on the touchscreen. <laughs> actually good to tell kids. I never had that problem. Now I'm trying to think if you actually did. I had someone step on my DS and break the top screen, but oh, that's not any fault of mine. Oh, God. Oh, horror stories. This is where DeRoach came from. Nope. Oh, wait, no, that's Squeak Squad. Yep. Sorry, I see DeRoach here, and apparently he has an airship in here. Go to my ship. You know, Kirby, he makes friends with every every enemy that oh, he Oh, that's true, that's true. So what is the main antagonist's name? Like... Darkness Evil Man, or... Necrodeus. Necrodeus, the thing that we saw and I completely forgot, my apologies. Death God? <laughs> yeah, God of Death. Necrodeus. Necrodeus oh. nuts. <laughs> anyway, please free, uh, free the last Kirby. Necrodeus will go by before I laugh at that joke. Alright, hey. max, max strength! At least you'll eventually laugh at it. Now we get extra score whenever we get- we fill that bar. Oh, perfect! A massive mobs of Kirby's- We need ten board. for this one! Ah! If we can actually, you know, get the spider out of the way. There we go. There we go! Boosh! 
So I watched a compilation on YouTube. It was suggested to me to watch a, a compilation of 80s, 90s, and 2000s commercials. Uh, nostalgia in, in a bag. GBA commercials, DS commercials, a lot of them came up, but also a lot of Betty Crocker. <laughs> well, well, yeah. I, I was able to quote the Zoo Books commercial. I had seen it so much. And the Tiger poster. 441 2400? That was the phone number! 800 441 2400. 800 441 2400. Call now. Uh, I'm about to say, do you need, do you need more? And that's just to unlock the way to the next stage? Yep. That seems too gimmicky. Just go to the next stage. Well, we had to go to the right stage. Oh. Gotcha. Okay. Oh, those aren't stage numbers. That's telling you how many Kirby's you need. Yes. I did not piece that together. All right. So uh, that's Kirby Mass Attack. Let me go ahead and show some of these extras in yeah, my yeah, yeah. other playthrough. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ooh, 58% clear. Got Field Frenzy, a music player, Kirby Brawl Ball, Kirby Curtain Call, Dash Course, and Strata Patrol EOS, and Kirby Quest. Some of these actually sound like Kirby games. Field Frenzy. Whack-a-mole. <laughs> okay, so this is the Mario 64 DS equivalent of just having mini games in your game because it's fun. Popular around this time. I know there's no like proper way to do this now with the Switch and everything, but I would kind of love to come back to something like this. I mean, I know you can still have mini games in your video game, but the DS just hit different. Nah, Nintendo outlawed them. Oh my god! That was amazing, dude. Oh, let me do that. Uh. Yeah, what else you got? Next up is... Music Player, which is self-explanatory, I'm sure. Kirby Brawl Ball! You got Battle Balls? Oh, it's Pinball! Pinball. Well, where? Oh, oh, there we go. <laughs> good start, good start. I'd say so. I thought you were just about to, to ball out there. That's my luck in pinball, you see. I'm trying to think of how good we did when we played uh, Kirby's Kirby Pinball. No. Not very good? No. See, my memory's garbo, so I don't... Like, I, rem I know that we did it, I just don't remember anything that happened in it. That's why you archive everything, right? Exactly. I keep everything. No matter how insignificant it is to the project, I keep it. Oh, shit. Okay, so no more on the right side. Man, now I just want to play Pokemon Pinball. Any pinball. Give me all the pinball. I do like that this is just a mini-game in a Kirby DS game. Love that. Then you get it. What else we got? We have... Kirby Curtain Call! A... Rhythm game? Oh. Ta-da! Oh, Curtain okay. Call! Gotcha, so it's a memory game. for Kirby's. Wow! I love how they actually had to put the copyright for this specific one, which means technically we are Let's Playing multiple Kirby games in one one-shot. <laughs> it's a stocking stuffer of Kirby games. I know! It's great! Okay, five curbs. I'm pretty sure there were 29 there. Oh. <laughs> no! Okay, good. Dash course! Do a 36. Oh, that's kind of cool. Yeah, just press the correct one. Oh, I love that. Oop. Yeah, let's go back to beach volleyball and press the face buttons of the PlayStation 3 or 4 or whatever.
Hey, 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 hey. Ah, well, you get it. Hey, I got it, I got it, man. Get as far as you can. Next up, Strata Patrol EOS. They're nice and bite sized which is another, uh, another thing I like about this. This could be a real game on its own. Oh, shit! Okay, I love this. Just a straight up sh over the head shmup, are you kidding me? With real analog controls because, oh, what? Here we go. You even have orbiters. It makes sense within the context of the game. Love it. Oh my god, move over, Otomedius. Excellent. We got Kirby, or Strato Patrol EOS. Oh, this is fabulous. Crap, now <laughs> I need to look up how much this game is. I want it. I think these are about as. Uh, these are all the bonus games I could get. I don't think there's much left I could, I could do. That was the real reason why I wanted to talk about this, because of all the crazy uh, side games they have here that are, I'd say, even a little better than the main game it's, itself! It's so cool! Like, this right here, this would have been my jam during the DS era. I would have loved this. Kirby Mass Attack. I noticed we never had to deal with Kirby's obesity in this game, which is unfortunate. Let's see. Okay, so it's not expensive as I thought. You can get a factory sealed version for 60 bucks. What about the other DS Kirby games? Other DS Kirby games, uh, na uh like Squeak Squad? Squeak Squad, Canvas Curse, and Ultra Deluxe. Ultra, uh, Superstar Deluxe. Squeak Squad, let's see, what are we looking Superstar at here? Superstar Ultra, that's what. Uh, complete in box, 2006. Woo! Uh, 52 bucks, plus shipping. Sounds about right. Uh, Super... Is it Superstar Ultra? Yeah. Okay. Kirby Superstar Ultra... That's only, like, 30, 40 bucks. Okay, so they're not nearly as bad as I would have thought, but some people, you know, they go crazy with it and just, like... How about Canvas Curse? Uh, this one might be interesting. Kirby... Canvas... Curse... For the Nintendo DS. Uh, between... Hmm. Between 30 and 60. I found one complete in box with manual, authentic, tested, $53.99 plus five bucks shipping. See, I also found another one. This is probably because it's not in the greatest condition. Uh, for about 20 bucks. Like new. Yeah. Okay, so results may vary when it comes to uh, Kirby games. Well, this has been fun. What else we got? We got a couple more, I think. Kirby Quest, last one. Hacky slashy gamey? It's in chapters. Oh. Okay. Final Kirby Fantasy! That's actually awesome. You have to time your attacks as well. Oh, and you get more powerful! Stage two. Fight! Raw Dynablade! Jeez! <laughs> okay, yeah. This was worth talking about. I friggin- this freaking rules. Ah, oh, so close. Jesus. Oh, Whoa! it's not Dynablade every time. Three of them now. Holy crap, this is awesome. I love this. Oh my god, he's so screwed. Oh. Hey, here we go. Let's I'm, keep it going. I'm glad you are the Kirby man. Being able to show me these. Uh, oh! Being able to show me these awesome Kirby games. Yeah, man. <laughs> I'm trying to think of. Oops. See, I thought it'd be fun to do triple deluxe, but at the same time, you know, I'm not the Kirby guy. Maybe one day I'll do a Kirby game. If you do a 3DS game, I call Robobot. Okay. Oh, no. I did play Robobot. Played the shit out of Robobot, actually. It was really fun. Robobot was good. Whoa, boss time! Oh. 
So do they fight back, or...? I think they run. I think this is about score. Gotcha. Right, that should be death. Yep. 900 EXP. Number 7 is here to fight. Is this like 10 stages per, or...? Like 10 or 12, I think. 10 or 12, okay. <laughs> Good lord! You mess with the Kirby mob, yeah. you get run over by a tank! Everybody knows that, come on. Come on, yeah. Final battle! Oh! What's up, Deeds? <laughs> oh! Oh, shit. Uh-oh. Okay, they do fight back. There goes one. No! Is uh, getting the uh, the awesome attack? Is that like max damage? Probably, yeah. We'll see. Yeah, let's see. Okay, yeah. And it brings my dude back to life. Nice. And do it again. again! Whoa! Oh, okay, that's pretty great. Different attacks every single time. Lovely. Yeah. That's so fun. Thank you for showing me this. Well, that was Mass Attack, and that's about the extent I wanted to talk about it. Just a few levels to show you what it's all about, and then all the mini-games. Yep, some of the, some of the fun stuff. That's, that's Mass Attack. Now, I believe it is time for my next present. It is. So let's see, yours is the number hands. 18, so it's number hurting. 19. Yeah, we had to go back on an old DS, <laughs> which means not good for big-handed gentlemen. Yeah, no. But, uh, here you go. All right, number 19. Okay, this is a large DVD case. See if you can guess what game, what game it's, what generation this is from, just by feel. Hmm. You probably haven't felt one of these in a while. Might be a Wii U case. I'm thinking Wii U. Interesting guess. Thought, but it's a full-size, uh, DVD case. Could be PS2, but it feels light for a PS2 game. Like, there's no manual in there, so it tells me it's a bit later than normal. So I'm just, let's just open it up and see what we got here. It's an Xbox game. A regular Xbox game. Why? <laughs> Why, man? Come on! Man, fuck you! <laughs> Payback for last year, bitch! What, what was last year? Oh, I remember. Okay. okay. <laughs> Well, well, at least this one's name brand, right? Yep. Okay. The real McCoy. All right. See you then.